Hey everyone, Merry Christmas. Welcome back it's to not, Zelda. It's not December yet. It's not even so December fuck yet. Off. It's not even December we yet. We just had Thanksgiving. We did. Turn some lights on it so was, we can see what the fuck we're doing. It was magnificent. Did you? You had a nice Thanksgiving? Yeah, it's good. It's good. Just got to spend some time with your family? Yeah, and then play some Xbox afterwards. Well, that sounds like a nice Thanksgiving. Indeed. See, I always dread Thanksgiving, and I never have well, a good because you, Thanksgiving. Your family is your family. Yeah. I love spending time with my family. No, I, can't I love it. I hate spending time. And and here's the worst part about the whole thing. I had three Thanksgivings back to back to back, all the same food, all the same stuff. So now you're fat and bloated because you had the same meal three times. Yeah. Well, isn't there a skeleton over there? I have to. To get off the vine there, son, oh, Jim. Oh, I thought maybe you could <laughs> swing while on the vine. No. Anyway, um, yeah, and each one was better than the last, at least. Mm hmm So, like, Thanksgiving Day was the most, like, was one of the worst Thanksgivings I've ever had, ever. It was terrible. Like, really, really fucking terrible. I'll go more in detail about it. But then the second one was a little better, but still kind of meh. And then I really enjoyed my, yesterday, we had our third Thanksgiving um, my first Thanksgiving was with my dad, <laughs> and uh, he thinks he can cook. He can't. He can't. He cannot cook. That man cannot cook. His life depends on everything so goddamn dry. When he makes potatoes, like when he makes mashed potatoes, he uses real potatoes, right? And you're like, oh, okay, good. He doesn't season them. No salt, no butter, no cream, no Why nothing. The hell would he, no he just he just boils some mashed potatoes, push them and whisks them like this, and then puts them on the table. I'd been like, give me a bucket of salt, please. <laughs> Something to fucking flavor that up. Right? Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. And That's awful. And then he made, like, baked corn, which my family's big on baked corn. Mm -hmm. And um, it's, like, undercooked and soggy. Green beans, you know, he made a green bean casserole when you put those little um, crunchies on top. Yeah, of them. whatever them they, things They were are. soggy, like, wet, like, slurpy, like oh, noodles. That's yeah. Great. Very disgusting meal. And then afterwards, after we feed ourselves, you know, full of just food, he's like, let's go for a walk. Why? Yeah, because that's what everybody wants to do, right? After, after they I, I mean, themselves. immediately after eating, he's like, okay, we're going to go for a walk before we have dessert. So we literally walked from, from our house, um, probably about what I would consider it, probably about half a mile down the road to go to this pond over by a dam so that he knows what and it wasn't for us it was for him to go check on this pond because he might have to do some maintenance on it or whatever oh, and was Jesus checking his fucking cry and then of course on the way down he's talking to every neighbor going hey how's it going how's your thanksgiving bothering them on thanksgiving day when their families that are man is lonely mm -hmm. that man needs some friends well not only that but my sister and my wife decided they wanted to go black friday shopping so after we were done with our walk, we had we didn't even get dessert. We had to run off and go to Black Friday shopping, which was I, it gets more ridiculous every year. I'm done with it, dude. I, fuck Black Friday. I'd be happy now that it's on again. Thursday. Yeah. Fuck that. I don't go. I didn't the, go. The deals aren't even that good, dude. No, they're not. They're not. There was almost nothing there. I I did get a real good deal on on, on two things, which I'm a little happy about. But could I have lived without them and gotten them later? Um, I got, uh, actually speaking of Zelda, I got uh, Zelda Twilight Princess for the HD yeah. for the Wii U. Normally, and it was with the Amiibo figure, so it was normally like a $60 thing. I got it for $25. So for a $25 buck game, I'm not going to complain. You know what I mean? Right, yeah. I haven't gotten a chance to start playing it yet, but um, well, good. I'd like to give it a try. That way I could at least say, hey, I've actually played a Zelda game. Right. And like I said, if I would continue this, I would want to do Majora's Mask and then probably that. Twi yeah, so if I can get, if I can play and beat Twilight Princess, then I, I can at least play that one after you're done with the other two. So, dun, dun, dun. that'd be cool. Anyway, though, um, and the only other thing I got was we, they were, everybody was going crazy because um, the um, Skylander Imaginators were going on sale, and I was like, I really just... I want a special version. I don't want the version that they have. I'm going to ignore it and forget about it. It's normally like $70. It was down to $40. And I'm like, I'm not going to get it. I'm going to wait. But then all of a sudden, Jen finds the edition I do want that's $100 at the same price for $40 online. And I'm like, get it. Buy it. Done. There's a $100 game for $40. Bucks. 
I wasn't even complaining. That's a lot of money you save. Darn it, I hate the song of time. <laughs> yeah. Dun, so. Dun, yeah, dun, so we did that. Dun, dun. Um, and and the real thing, you know what I really hated about it, I think, is because we went with, with my sister. And she went there for her goddamn cell phone. She was getting a new cell phone. So not only did she have to wait in line till 6 o'clock to get her voucher, but then she had to come back at 9 o'clock in order for her to actually have them activate her phone. You were having one hell of a time. I need you to remember this for me real quick. Um, right, right A down. Okay. Right A down. Right, right A, down. A down. It's the same thing. Yeah, right A down, right, right A, a down. down. Right A down, right A down. Yep. Okay. Right A down. Right A down. Me and John used to just like write them on a piece of paper and <laughs> yeah, have it right next to us, which is yeah. a hell of a lot easier than keep I, I, looking in the I fucking figured, menu. I, I figured that's what you would do. Yeah, well, should really take the time to do that. So. <laughs> Maybe we'll do it after this. Maybe we so should, because it's just, it really holds me the fuck up. Yeah, fuck you, just, plant! And we're just sitting here trying to be like... But anyway, yeah, so then we had, fucking to, bitch! We had to sit there until 9 o'clock her for her to get her goddamn cell phone. Only for her for the next three days to complain about her cell phone. I'm like, then why did we wait in line for this stupid thing? People pushing and shoving and having a big ordeal. They did something different this year too. All the DVDs, Blu-rays, video games. Mm -hmm. They had a line to be able to go in and look at it. They shot you through a cattle chute. And had people one at a time look at the DVDs and Blu-rays and video games. Really? Yeah. So the line pretty much went down like the registers. It was it was like a good long line. I stood in line for probably 45 minutes. Around 8 o'clock. Like it started at 6 and I was just going to pick over the leftovers. And at 8 o'clock, I stood in line for about 45 minutes to get to the Zelda and some other video games. It's, just, it's an awful time. Yeah, it was not... It's like, why why, why go? They're not even great deals. Like, They're oh, not. Yeah. People love that. Do you need a new TV every year? No, you fucking don't. <laughs> no, you fucking you don't. don't. You know. Mike Munson posted something that said, you know, people are killing each other over a TV. What's going to happen when we're out of food? food? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's true. Post, yeah. Fucking people are nut jobs. They are. Um, I was gonna say something else about that. Oh, well, <laughs> and it was it was really tricky. But have you heard of these fucking hatch animals? No. Hatch animals? They're the new fucking Furbies or whatever. This year, they're the number one toy. Really? Because basically, it's a Furby, but you hatch it out of an egg. That's like it comes in a big plastic egg, and you hear its heartbeat, and 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 it slowly pecks itself out of the egg. And then it talks to each other and sings songs and plays and does everything a Furby does. Well, that's just okay. fucking silly. Well, they're they're normally sixty dollars, okay, for that for that hatch animal or whatever. But however, whatever, sweetie, go back to sleep. What'd she say it was called? Hatch. So you saying it wrong? I'm probably saying it wrong. That doesn't surprise me, like at all. Hatchimal. I'm sorry. Hatchable. Hatchimal. Hatch a mole. Hatchable elector. No, then hatch a bull. Hatch a mole. Hatch a mole. Yeah. Hatch a mole. Like hatchy, and then like hatch a mole. Like hatch a mole. Silly. Whatever. Point is. Ah! Oh, you fucking whore. Hey, fuck you. Stupid bitch ass fucking plane, I'll kill you. <laughs> God damn. The point is, there's oh! these damn thing called hatchimals. And they normally sell for 60 bucks, the hot new toy this year. And um, they're normally $60. And they had them on sale on Black Friday for 40 Okay, and we were like, well, do we really want... It's a $20 saving. What the hell's the big deal? Let's just, you know... I went and looked it up online to see what I can get, what I can find for it online. It's over $200 online. Jesus fucking Christ. Because they're in such high demand. My wife went in to get one for her niece, and she stood in line. And um, she got one of the last of the four tickets. Really? And there were like 20 people behind her waiting for tickets, and they're like, "Sorry, no, you didn't get here early enough. They're all gone." And they they wouldn't even allow you to put it in your cart. They had you had to drive around back because you would get pummeled and people would beat you up and shoot you for it. It's like the tickle me Elmo craze. Like everybody's going nuts over it. Fuck that. I know, right? I ain't getting nobody's kids that. Well, the funny that thing is, is, it's not even like it's not even my my wife's getting it for her niece. My wife's getting it for her brother to give to his niece. Well, guess what? He should fucking do it. But himself. that's exactly what she said. But she was Fuck already that. up there. Fuck she that! Said, you know what? I would have laughed and said, "Fuck you." Hell no. <laughs> Oh, oh hell no. no! To the no! To the let's hurt ourselves! Well, fuck! I was gonna say it's gonna hurt if I fall. And um, 
And you, I'm sure you can imagine what going to my mother's was like the day after. Just awful. Friday, yeah, we went up and uh, it was better than dad. We didn't have to go for a walk afterwards, you know what I mean? I ate my fill. We sat everybody down. wants to nap after fucking <laughs> dinner and they're like, let's right. go for a walk. No, we, yeah, we literally ate and then sat down and walked. Catherine wanted to watch Pocahontas 2. Because I brought Pocahontas and Pocahontas 2 thinking, what other fucking Thanksgiving movie can you bring to watch for Thanksgiving? There's none. There's none. So I was like, okay, Pocahontas and Pocahontas 2. And she's like, I've never seen Pocahontas 2. And there's a reason for that, because it's terrible. <laughs> it's one of the worst movies. Yeah, I don't remember. I liked it when I was a kid, but I don't remember it. Pocahontas 2? You liked Pocahontas 2? Yeah. I haven't seen it since I was a kid. Sometimes you watch something as a kid and you're like, oh, yeah, yeah, no, you dude, look back at a... We're gonna... Like Mulan 2? I've oh. never seen it. Oh. They make it sound stupid. Oh, it's terrible. And I don't want to see that. They, they make a well, lot of them too. No, we'll, we'll, I'll, I'll have ass. to talk to you about Pocahontas 2 next time, guys. We'll see you um, next time here on fucking Pocahontas Zelda.